Hello guys, welcome back to another Commander game. We're going to play Aloro again. And we are against Xenagos. So they got some beatdowns. We got a good hand though. Turn 2 Signet, turn 3 Vindicate. Hopefully turn 4 Control Magic, but we'll see how that goes. Then it goes is indestructible though, so there is that. Decree of Pain. Elspeth seals with Xenagos. So does control magic for that matter. Oof. Um So I guess we want blue and black. No, we got black. We'll get blue white. Hollowed Fountain. Frixine Arena. Not a terrible one. Alright, F6. Hope he doesn't have a Crows and Grip here. Looks like he does not. So what is that? It goes four or five mana. Okay. Another one. And a Scalding Tarn. Alright, so he's got his red mana. Not much else going on. Do I vindicate a land? One, two, three. I'll we'll have three mana if I do. Yeah, I'm gonna try it. All right. See if that sets him back enough. At least since then it goes back one turn. Ooh, he got me back. Fair enough. Alright, well, we drew our blue again. But we're just gonna drop Arena and pass. See what he's got. Xenagos time. Acidic Slime. Arena or my mana, though? Arena, okay. Both hurt, for sure. Or end. Exile target non-land permanence. I mean, I'll hold it up. It's probably gonna play as a Xenagos here, then go to combat, I guess. Alright, so he still gets the trigger this turn. But he is going to have to recast it next turn. Another land, good for us. So we've got five mana. I think we just hold up to create pain. Nothing I really want to control magic. Guys, cradles. Quite the land. Then it goes again, so we'll cycle. Kills the slime. Then it goes was actually a creature, huh? Uh no wait. He's a two color, so we need seven devotion, not five. Alright. Factor Fiction. That's a good one. Let's give haste. Yes. So he can play whatever he wants and swing with it next turn. Freaking Cygnus Man. Alright, well, we're going to take a hit. 
not much we could do about that this time. Hopefully, well, that's not too scary. What does he have? I want to be able to steal Xenagos with control magic. That's okay. Oh, that's a creature? I didn't even notice. Huh. Interesting. Alright, so I could drop I could place Sarin, drop his life to ten, and then plan to control magic something next turn. I can Elspeth exile that now, probably just we'll use Elspeth on the backswing, or I could leave up factor fiction. I think I wanna go this route. Target life total becomes 10. Alright. See if he even bothers to attack Soren here. I'm just hoping he turns that into a creature so I can control magic it. It's pretty much my game plan. That will do it. Does control magic fall off if it's not a creature? Actually. That could be something to worry about. So I guess it doesn't give trample, it's good to know. So yeah, I can troll magic the Bailoth instead. Actually, just dropping Elspeth here would <laughs> be pretty good as well. So he's crying, so he's empty handed. Just about. Kessig Wolf Run. Alright, so we take some damage. Are we dead? I don't think so. Oh, yeah, he had to take Soren out, too. Alright, so I think I just Elspeth and minus her. Pretty comfortably here. Alright. Then I guess it was indestructible, that's right. So he's gonna be able to bash us. I forgot this is an ex exile. Alright, well, see if you can turn it into a creature. It's a lot of mana, so. Warm coil. Skull clamp. I wonder if I was just dead to him because they go fronting on warm coil or something. Put the skull clamp on the warm coil, attacks for 14. How much can he put into war? Eight. Alright, I'm not quite dead. I survive at one. Wait, this does give trample? Where is he getting trample from? Oh, wolf run. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, he gains all his life back. Well of lost dreams. I think I just lose to Wolf Run. I don't think I really have an answer to that. All right, I could control magic, whatever, it doesn't matter. You pump anything with Wolf Run, and I lose to it.
Fact or fiction, probably not enough. Should have floated a mana there. Whoops. Dissipate. I'm not gonna do it. Uh it's close. Very close. It's just the wolf run. Let us fact or fiction. See what we can find. Path keeps us alive. So I just path whatever he gives trample to. And block everything else with soldiers. Still, just gives me one more turn. Hmm, okay, he's gonna have two tramplers. Alright, fair enough. He's got it. Worm coil big. Why? Why is he doing it like that? Why wouldn't he attack? Give this haste, and then you can just give anything else trample. It's like he's just intentionally giving me an extra turn here. Unless he has something else. Am I missing something? <laughs> Not sure. I follow. Okay, now I'll be serious. Okay, bro. Oh, we just drew a land, so it doesn't really matter. So he just has to play Xenagos. Pop Worm Coil. Give that trample. Well, play to our outs. Really all he has to do is wolf round for a bunch, right? We're playing Xenagos instead. We're in elves, okay. So I could just chump walk. This guy is awful. What is he doing? <laughs> Wrath of God. What does it? It 
Attack with all the things. Alright. Oh, right. I died to these guys, huh? Yeah. Just to give one of them trample. Alright, oh, Wolfron got us. I don't have an answer to it. Oh, could I have minus Elspeth there instead of... I mean, Dragonlord gets us either way. Well, I guess not. But... Wolfron gets us either way. So if I minus 3 to Elspeth, I would have had to lose Elspeth, but I would have killed his big worm coil, and then I could have Wrath afterwards, I guess. Hmm, it might have worked. I would still be... Ooh, I would still be dead. I mean, I still, like... I don't really have the land destruction for the wolf run, so... And I'd be without Elspeth, that's the problem. Alright, that should be game. Not really looking at where he's attacking, but if he's just hitting my face. Good game. Rings, yeah. Alright, well, with those draws, definitely was not winning. Alright, anyways, that was a good game. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.